Hey y'all, let's look at today divisibility. Now this is something, first off, again, you should, before you try to tackle algebra, you've got to know those division tables and the times tables, pluses and minuses, all that kind of thing, because that's going to really be a big deal to help you save a lot of time doing algebra one um, problems. So you can focus on the actual algebra and not on the arithmetic. So this is a really neat chapter. It gives you a lot of good stuff about what's divisible by what you can look at it and tell what are what what numbers are divisible by it's a really very handy tool to know okay well let's look at this two is a factor of 30 which means two divides in the 30 with no remainder right okay so you could have uh other factors of 30 as well um what are the other factors of 30 well if we multiply two times 15 those are two factors what other factors are there of 30 I said, yep, yeah, 3 and 10. If you know your times tables, you should automatically think, you know, 6 and 5, obviously 30 and 1, and so on. So a lot of different factors of 30, okay? Let me show you some rules of divisibility. These are really neat. Copy this down, and again, make sure you are doing this with your notes. Okay, here's your notebook paper. Go ahead and do 10, so you can look back and figure out if you can't figure out some kind of problem, you know, you'll see these problems. It'll say, you know, here's the problem in your book, blah, 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 blah. And then right to the left, it'll have 72 or whatever. And then you'll know to go to less than 72 to figure that out. So you'll know exactly where to look in your notes if you have that. Okay, rule number one, obey all rules. Never mind. That was an Andy Griffith thing there. Okay, rule number one for divisibility. A number is divisible by two if the last digit is 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. In other words, every even number is divisible by 2. Okay? Rule 2, and of course you can stop these anytime and copy, copy this down, but make sure you have a nice page of these notes. A number is divisible by 3 if the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. In other words, let's say you have the number, I don't know, 7, uh, 5, you know, 2, 1, for example. You can look at that and go, okay, 7 plus 5, 12. 12 plus 2 is 14. 14 plus 5, uh, 1 is 15. So the digits in this number add up to 15. Is the number 15 divisible by 3? Yeah. So there you go. So you can actually, if you're, if you're not sure where to start, well, you can start with a 3 now and divide and you can knock down things. We're going we're gonna to reduce fractions and do all kinds of things with this. So, okay. Rule number 3. A number is divisible by 5 if the last digit is either 5 or 0. So 1,055 divisible by 5. You know, 62,800,490 is divisible by 5. Because really, the number 10, of course, is divisible by 5. And any fact, any a multiple of 10, 10, 20, 30, 40, any of those are also divisible by 5 as well. Okay, number is divisible by 10 if the last digit is a zero, so that's pretty obvious, okay? All right, let's look at this. Which of these numbers are divisible by three? Let's take a look at this one. Is this divisible by three? Well, nine plus nine is 18. 18 is divisible by three, so yep, there it is, okay? 1,239, one plus two is three, three plus three is six, six plus nine is 15, 15 is divisible by three, so that number is as well. 1,561, let's check it out. 1 plus 5 is 6, 6 plus 6 is 12, 12 plus 1 is 13, which is not divisible by 3 even, so that is not divisible by 3, okay? Let's check this one. Which of these numbers are divisible by 2, 5, and 10? Okay, let's check it out. Which are divisible by 2? Is this, yep, even number, even number. This one is not, not divisible by 2, not divisible by 2, even number, yes. Okay, so those three are divisible by two. All right, let's try some different ink color here so we can get them straight here. Which is divisible by five? It needs to be ending in a five or a zero. Nope, nope, yes, nope, yes, and yes. All right, which one's divisible by 10 has to end in a zero. So the only one that is, is this one right here. So that is divisible by all three, 4,020. So when you're doing problems like this, you can start, when you look at this number and go, uh oh, what's it divisible by? Remember your division rules. Go back if you need to, to, you know, less than 10, if you have one of these, then you can just, you know, work with or mess with these numbers and break them down the fractions and do all kinds of things with factor trees and stuff like that that we're gonna do in the future. So, okay, there we go. 
Try practice problems on page 40. Go ahead and pause it. Just do all of them. Do all of them, pause it, and come on back. Let's talk about it in a second. Okay, let's take a look here. Which of these numbers are divisible by 3? Wow, look at all these things. Let's, I'm going to actually write these down. Oop, give away my secrets there. Okay. Okay, so we got 47,285, 45, 285. Good grief, what is this? 305, oops, that's a 961, and 235, 725. Good gravy, 84603, and then 72840. Okay. Which are visible by three, five, and ten. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna kinda like do this. Three, five, and ten, and then ugh, none of these. Alright. Let's do ten first. The only one that's divisible by ten, obviously, is this one, because it ends because it ends in a zero. The only one that's divisible by five, well, this one ends in a five. Yes, yes, no. Doesn't end in a five or a zero. This one is no, but this one also is. Now, what's divisible by three? You're going to have to add all, add all the digits every single time to figure this out. So, let's try it. 4 plus 7 is 11, plus 2 is 13, 13 plus 8 is uh, 21, plus 5, 26. 26 is not divisible by 3, so no. 4 plus 5 is 9, 11. Uh, 19 plus 5 is 24. That is divisible by 3, so yes, that is as well. 3 plus 0 plus 5 is 8, plus 9 is 17, plus 17 plus 6 is 23, plus 1 is 24. That's also divisible by 3, so that is divisible by 3. 2 plus 3 plus 5 is 10, 17, 19, 24. What the heck is this with all the all 24s here? So that's also divisible by 3 as well. Let me check that. 14, uh, yeah, that's it. Okay. 8 plus 4 plus 6 is uh, 18, plus 3 is 21, so this is also divisible by 3. So there's your rule. Keep those handy. They're very handy to know, and uh, we'll work with those more the rest of the year. So, all right, see you guys next time. Take care.